Magnematics is a high technology spin out. It was formed in 2006 from the University of Sheffield. We're commercialising magnetic gears, so that's gears that use magnets instead of gear teeth. We have a, a number of collaborative projects which involve the university. So a typical example of that would be the EMAS project. So that's a project which was originally identified by Kay Satella within the engineering department of the university. The introduction of magnetic gearing, it, it allows electric motors to actually produce the required power and torque with half the size. And because to be able to achieve efficiency in vehicles, in ships, you need to reduce size as much as you can. And this technology has allowed that. As a company, they don't have all the expertise in-house, so they always try to tap to the expertise at the university in terms of control or looking at the things more in-depth, which usually companies can't do because of the business constraints. So this is a, a novel component that we have within the magnetic gear, so this is, if you like, the, the heart of the gear. And what's very important is that this component mustn't cause noise and vibration. So we're actually working with Jem in the, in the dynamics part of the university and we're actually transferring some of his knowledge into this product. At the University of Sheffield, we have uh, a large number of academics who have interests in all sorts of areas. In this case, we have a large research group in dynamics and uh, Magnematics were able to access some of the skills from the different academics in their areas. So my area is vibrations and damping vibrations. Additionally, we're able to help them with planning some of the funding applications they're making. We're able to give some advice there. We're able to discuss with uh, Magnematics about their need for somebody in the company who could do some of the testing and analysis that we had developed with them. They took on Rob Barrett, who was one of our graduates. I began at Magnematics as a summer intern placement student. I was given a mentor who guided me through the design processes, uh, from which point I was offered a job at Magnematics and now I'm a mechanical design engineer. I've completed research in the dynamics and structural responses of machines at Magnematics. The results of this research have allowed us to produce more robust rotating machines. A lot of this research has developed from my summer internships at Magnematics. So getting good engineers for us is a real challenge. So we inter interact with the university in three ways. The first thing is we actually sponsor PhDs. So we've sponsored, I think now, three PhDs. And one of those is actually now a full-time employee with the company. So we've effectively used his PhD to improve our technology, but also we've then taken him on as a skilled engineer. We have close links to the university, so we're able to actually spot talent within the, the undergraduate departments. We then offer some of those engineers work placements. The final area is we actually have placements within the university. So we have two people currently in the company who are doing PhDs part-time at the university. So again, we're improving their skills by the interaction with Sheffield. And I'd encourage any other business in the region to, to, to make contact with the university and explore possibilities. Because for us, it's made us you know, the world leader in our technology.